Okay, I'd like to just say a few words about the question of um, the right to the city, uh, which more broadly means um, who has the right uh, to public space in the city, the right to have a say in how cities are um, built, how they change, um, and what cities can mean for different groups of people. Uh, I think it was 20 or so years ago that uh, Richard Sennett said that the fundamental aspect of, of um, managing um, urban space is keeping a good balance between openness and control, or openness and order. What he meant by that was either um, allowing people the room to be creative in the city, but at the same time to have a sort of a, a baseline of at least order so that people can, can feel safe within the city. Some people would say that this shift has gone too much towards order uh, over the last few years, and that there's not enough room for creativity. Um, the usual reason for this over the last few years has been the question of uh, the so-called neoliberal um, urban governance today, where market forces have a bigger say in defining who should be in the city, uh, with the result that it's often consumers rather than an inclusive form of urban um, openness.